All right, Sid Perry asks, hey, how do I put a noise gate on there? In Cakewalk, there is a gate that you can use called the Sinitis Gate. So what you wanna do is you wanna click on whatever track that you're trying to work on, you wanna put the gate on, and you're gonna go over to your inspector, which is on the left. And then right here, I can add the effect. I'm gonna to go to insert audio effects. I'm gonna go down to dynamics, and then I'm gonna to go to what's called the Sinitis Great. A sin Sinitis gate, not Sinitis great, but it is great though. All right, and I can listen to this track and see what it sounds like. So I'm gonna mute two of these takes and just play this first one. Thank. Do, do, do. Okay, so the point of a gate is to actually get rid of the unwanted sound that's in between what I'm singing and what's naturally going on in the room. Like it can be voices going by, it can be this noise that you always hearing on the videos because I'm always pressing on this keyboard uh, drawer that opens up out of my desk and sometimes it makes noise. So there are presets in here that you can use. So I'm gonna go to the preset section. I'm gonna go to Sinitis and then I'm gonna go to default gate, all right? Now, gate, you're gonna have to play around with it a little bit because it might not do exactly what you want it to do. And sometimes they might chop it off too much. I really use this. I'm dealing with like snares or yeah, or I feel like one unwanted sounds. So you can notice that the threshold went all the way up to zero. If you bring the threshold Ooh. down, you'll start to hear the sound. Do. And if you bring it all the way down, Do. it should be natural. So if I bring it up some, Okay, now you can notice really chopping it off. So I can bring it about right there. You can also adjust the depth. Okay, when I have the depth all the way up, it should just be natural. Everything is coming through. Now bring it down. You can also adjust the attack on here. You can also adjust the hold and you can adjust the release and look ahead. Uh, any of these things will help get the sound that you're looking for. So you're really looking for something. You hear the note, you hear what you're trying to do, but you don't want all the little extra stuff that's going on in between what you're singing. So I hope this helps. Uh, if you want a full tutorial about the gate, exactly how to really, really use it, then let me know. But this is just something real short to answer your question.